a dope beat, God bless the dead. Free me right now, I'm in the feds. Niggas say they was starving, super came to save the streets. Certified trap music with cards and banks on the beat. First tape did numbers, what you get is what you see. So you know we had to call this one, yeah, all yeah, eyes on yeah, me. Federal. Hey, hey RP, my nigga Dope B, you know what I mean? Wish I would've got a chance to meet you. Damn, Damn son. Tune in, all eyes on me. Hosted by Frank White, Trevor Allen. As far as Carlos Banks, you working with him as a producer, as a director? Yeah, I fuck with Carlos Banks the, the long way. You know what I'm saying? He was a real talented person. Hard working. Like, you can't cheat the grind. So like he been in the game so long way before me. I been on doing shit doing like three years, you know what I'm saying? I'm just at this shit, so he kinda can guide me to wow. Shit that he didn't been through or shit that he didn't seen other people go through, so he rock with me and I rock with him. We make hard shit together, so I'm fucking with him. Salute to Carter Bay. Alright, so like his beats, what you could describe as his beats being. A nigga make hard beat shit. See what money bad yo them doing right now. Hey. You see they fucking mm. with them hard, like the nigga hard. No, I he see hard the people like, fucking with them. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But to lose the, all the producers out there, all them niggas be hard, but yeah. call the bangers, that's my number one guy. But how yeah. far you think you come? I came a long way. I ain't gonna lie, I came a, I came a long way in this rap shit, like my first project was Save the Street. That bitch did number though. You know what I'm saying? That bitch did like 200,000. I'm lying, me to tell you, it was a high ass scope. But it all lies on me though. Like, I just got way better. I just yeah. working on my craft. And so I saw you do it, did a song with Schoolie. Yeah. So what was that about? Yeah, shout out to Schoolie, man. Yeah, I was a fan of Schoolie. Before I was rapping, growing up, I just listened to them niggas, real kid. So shit, when he reached out to me and I had the opportunity to work with him, you know what I'm saying? I pulled up on him down that street as this and we came out with a banger, duffel bag. You know what I'm saying? Oh, okay. And yeah, what do you think uh, as far as when you're around different people in the industry? I mean, it's just really what, what market you in because like, Alabama might not get respected like Atlanta and New York and shit, but you know what I'm saying? If I'm in Alabama, like, if I'm in that market, they fucking with a nigga strong. You know what I'm saying? You go to different market, though, you like, you know, it's gonna be different goddamn hospitality. Yeah, yeah, I understand that. I understand that. What made you wanna rap? Really, I never wanted to rap. You know what I'm saying? Really, really grew up playing sport. You know what I'm saying? Just trying to get some money. But at the same time, Dopey, Dopey on um, Big Hook. They um, was in the room one night, you feel me, I think. Doe had a show somewhere, and Big Hug and Doe like, man, you got a rap. Like, man, they gonna fuck with it, you got a rap. But like, when I see it in, you got a rap. So I thought, I was sitting down thinking about that shit, like, I need, I need a rap, you know what I'm saying? So I just tried that shit, and shit, just kept going at it, I just kept going, just kept going, just kept going. Yeah. Super. Yeah. And, and and as your song, like, how how do you come up with your song? What's your process? Not dissecting, like, really like you ain't got to tell these niggas, like, yeah, what you do, but I'm saying, like, what's your process? What are you thinking when you coming up with a song? Man, I just go in the booth and whatever be on my mind, whatever going on in my hood, where I'm wrong, where I'm from, that's, that shit just come out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just come out the, come okay. out the dome, just. So you gonna hear that yeah. shit, man. All eyes on me, like different shit. I'm talking about different situations. You know what I'm saying? All right. And the like nigga video, like, uh, can you describe that? Cause I know I saw your Snapchat myself, and it was crazy. Talk so, about it, though. Call the bank, gonna make a move about that motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I saw that scene, that motherfucker. Yeah, definitely. Boxing scene, dancing scene, like you got different shit. That bitch gonna be hard though. Yeah. They gonna fuck with. It. Yeah. Now, I know there's a whole lot of beef in the industry right now. There's a whole lot of shit going on. <laughs> like, and I just want to know, I'm just saying, is it anything that, you know what I'm saying, that you want to get off your chair? I ain't beefing with no nigga. You know what I'm saying? Every day I'm not trying to run up a sack. 
Uh, that's what it's called, like. It took my mind out there if you try to beat with a nigga. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? A nigga beat with me, they hate. You know what I'm saying? Because half a nigga, they be sneak this and shit. I don't even know these niggas, so. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. I'm running to a check, man. All that one was a motherfucking check. Yeah. Now, as far as your videos, can you tell people what's out there so they know where to go to? Man, I got a break the scale out there, 200 some thousand. Motherfucking be like this, 200 some thousand. Man, I got a lot of shit on YouTube, man, you know what I'm saying? Never miss the run. All I ever wanted was a check, my nigga hit. Free Junior Ball got one with him on there, fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of shit on that motherfucker. Uh, can you talk about Junior Ball? So, like, what's your relationship with him? Junior Ball, that my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Free Junior Ball, that my motherfucking partner, man. He a real nigga, real street nigga. Real get money nigga. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with niggas that get money, so... Like... He a real stand-up guy, you know what I'm saying? He got caught up in a humble, but he'll be back, you know what I'm saying? Nah, yeah, for, for sure. I, I met him a couple times myself, free drink boss for real. I'm on the same shit, some fuck shit, just bullshit, man. Live with it. So, so you can't control. Yeah, your shows, like, as far as how your performance goes. Man, every show I go to, for real, bitch, you be down there sold out, you know what I'm saying? Like. Nigga be booked up like a motherfucker and bitch be sold out. Yeah. Every time we pull up, bitch be sold out. We yeah. turn up in that motherfucker, we turn up in the whole block. Yeah, I know that your crowd be, you know, a little bit cleaner to your music more than other artists. They they kind of know you, they, they sing in the back to you, <laughs> basically. Yeah. yeah, they fuck with a nigga, man. I love all my fans. And that's one of the biggest attractions. So, and can you give me the the rundown from recording to doing the video? I mean, shit. I remember making that bitch on Tuesday. I made that bitch on Tuesday. You know what I'm saying? Me and JB. Shout out to JB. JB made that beat. He made the beat. I made that bitch on a Tuesday. Went to uh, twerk Tuesday that night and told Solo to run that bit. You feel me? I made that bit. We were like. I be the hard though. Uh, I'm like they gonna be the one. I was telling Junior, I'm like they gonna be the one right there for them baby. You know what I'm saying? They weren't, they weren't paying attention. They ain't believe me. So goddamn, I put that bitch out there too. Then solo ran that bitch and big boy. Folks, they went crazy to that motherfucker. I know Wednesday morning, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, every day on Facebook, Instagram, somebody was making a video to that motherfucker. Bad bitch with a head like nigga, you feel yeah. bitch that was going viral. No, I saw you set it out on that before. I was at one of the parties. Yeah. But um uh, but you know, other than that, what's like some off the album that you really uh that's like one of your Man, I can't really tell your... you for real, I'm back to you, January tenth. <laughs> I got See? so much hard shit on that motherfucker yeah. dog, like say the street. I fuck with say the street, but it all eyes on me like I put in work on that motherfucker, boy, they big one. They big gonna be a hood classic. You Can you tell me something about shooters though? Like that's something recently shooters. I saw. Shooters. I mean. Shooters. Shooters. That's my nigga on um, Money Man from the A. You know what I'm saying? He one of the hottest nigga coming out of the A right now. I dropped that shooter as a single. Just a game so they don't know how I'm coming. And that bitch don't crack no more. You know what I'm saying? Big got more like 10,000 downloads on motherfuckers. Spin Riller right now. Three oh. days. All right, that's hard. But the, the take gonna be goddamn. That be gonna be hard about it though. Southside shit, y'all already know. January 10th, all lies on me, drop nigga. Guaranteed hood classic. Fucking with it. Street gonna fuck with it. Just what going on right now, nigga. 2017, just what going on. Super! Like, um, for me, I know, like, you was an artist that was close with Dobie, so. Like, uh, what are your feeling towards that? And as far as like y'all relationship, how 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 was it? I mean, though, B was just my partner. He just was, you know what I'm saying? He was a cool guy, just like he was cool with everybody else. You know what I'm saying? Like, he just my nigga when that song, I was Gucci, and I heard that motherfucker. I had my partner. Like, Who the fuck is that? He was like, man, that Dobie. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, that bit hard as fuck. So I went back in that net week, he was in there. And we chopped it up and shit, whatever, whatever, and got down. I just was, I wasn't rapping or no shit like that, you know what I'm saying? I was in the street, I was fucking my people. Who all you got featured on the tape? 
I'm gonna tell you all that's on me. I got future money man, fathead, Doby, DA, Roban OG, and Junior Boss. All eyes on me. All eyes on me finna be a classic, man. They be a hard body. You know what I'm saying? Got something for the lady. Got something for the streets. Got something for the trap, nigga. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Supernova, what's up? It feels a boy. Yeah, it feels a boy. Yeah, I'm some you niggas ain't seen me.